Welcome to Business Stats AdCam, your online advertising campaign manager. Use AdCam to track all of your online ad spend, whether it's pay-per-click banner ads or email campaigns, AdCam can track it all. The purpose of this instructional video is to help you get started with AdCam. We'll show you how to set up a campaign and what to do once it's all set up. Setting up a campaign easy. First, simply mouse over the conversion icon along the top navigational bar. Then select Campaign Manager. Along the top, you'll have an option to start a new campaign. AdCamp will now present you with a three-step wizard. Now this can work for any type of campaign you are running, retargeting banner ads, email campaigns, QR codes, and more. For this, we are going to be setting up an AdWords campaign. First, it asks us to name our campaign. In this situation, be specific. Since I will be tracking an AdWords campaign, I will go ahead and type in AdWords campaign 2013. Now it asks for a campaign code related to this campaign. You can use a series of letters, numbers, whatever makes sense for your team to track it. This will also appear in the URL, so I normally suggest to keep it short. I'll choose ADW-1 and select Next. The next step is optional, but it does ask for a start and end date to your campaign. I'll go ahead and select No End Date. After that, it asks you for a total campaign cost. This field is really optimal when you are tracking a banner ad so that it can perform a reverse cost per click analysis. In the situation of AdWords, I'll go ahead and leave that blank. Now the next field is a conversion field. You can fill out this field when you are not taking use of the advanced level dynamic conversion snippet. Assuming you're not, go ahead and fill in the page that designates your conversion page. Most of the time, it is a thank you page, contact us page, I'll go ahead and start typing the actual page name and select the page from the drop down menu that equals my successful conversion page. You will get a green check mark to show you that you have checked a successful page. Then choose create a new campaign. What you're looking at is our special campaign URL that relates to this campaign. Anytime AdCam sees a clicks come from to your website with this promotion code attached to the end of it, it will attribute all of your traffic to this campaign. Then you can analyze it in a very granular fashion. Next, go ahead and choose Finish. Once you do, you're presented with the Campaign Manager section where you'll see the answers to everything you just filled out. Now your campaign is configured. Very important to go ahead and choose Test Your URL because you want to be sure that you've registered a successful test. Once you do, it means that your tracking snippet is really on that page and you can go ahead and say OK. Now by default, we always select traffic to go to your home page. If you did not want it to go to your home page, you would simply type in the page name or landing page that you wanted the traffic to go to. Always know that, however, that if this comes at the end of any of your campaign names, AdCam will track and attribute it to this campaign and URL. If you have any other variables you need to add to the string, be sure to place the AdCam variable first. Go ahead and choose highlight and copy this new campaign URL. In the situation of the Google AdWords campaign, I'll go ahead into my Google Management Center of our Google AdWords. Here we have our new campaign, and it's just asking for our destination URL. Go ahead and paste this URL into the destination URL box, erasing the part in front of it because it's already toggled, and then choose Save. Once you do, your ad is configured, and you have the ability now through AdCam to track all of the clicks coming in from that campaign. We're going to very quickly look at what's going to register. For campaigns that have results, you're going to see things like the number of click-throughs, the number of page views that it, those click-throughs resulted in, bounces, bounce rate, and that very almighty conversion. In the case of any campaign, you can go ahead and choose Detail, and you could see exactly the amount of clicks and the course the very granular user click path information. So you're all set up and you're off and tracking. Be sure to check out our AdCam Advanced Dynamic Conversion Snippet video to learn how to use the Dynamic Conversion Snippet on conversion pages. Also, be sure to check out our Identities Part 1 and Part 2 videos to learn how to use our Advanced Identities. Thank you very much.